An NYPD officer who was violently robbed while off duty in the Bronx has been released from the hospital. CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis reports he was surrounded by love and support. Once the doors of Jacoby Medical Center opened, NYPD officer Mohammed Chowdhury was met with cheers from his police family. <laughs> Leaving the hospital for the first time in more than two weeks with his wife and children by his side. We're really thrilled that Muhammad was able to walk out of the hospital safely and much better than when he first came in. On August 23rd, the 48-year-old was jogging in his Bronx neighborhood along Olmsted Avenue when he was attacked and robbed. The suspects left him with a fractured skull and brain bleeding. He was taken to the hospital where his cousin expressed gratitude Thursday. I would like to extend my sincere thanks on behalf of the police officer Muhammad Tahir Chowdhury's family. Hours before his hospital release, the NYPD took a 16-year-old boy into custody in the Bronx. Last month, police arrested 18-year-old Oshan Logan. Cops are still looking for two more suspects. We'll put the cuffs on them. We'll put the case together. We'll try to get justice for our police officer. And these other police officers from Central Park, it could be any of them. The rest of the justice system needs to do their part. Chowdhury is an 18-year veteran of the NYPD, assigned to the Central Park Precinct, where he is highly regarded. A cop's cop, and honestly, if I could pick somebody to respond to a 911 call involving my family, he'd be one of the people that I would choose. He is uh, dependable wonderful and really embodies what we call New York's finest. Leaving the hospital, sharing a thumbs up and a smile. Police say Chowdhury was taken to a rehabilitation facility, the next step on his road to recovery. At Jacoby Medical Center, Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News. Police believe the suspects in this case are part of a street gang involved in a slew of robberies. At least five arrests have been made on various incidents with more arrests expected.